everyone, Stacy Burke here, and it is a Monday, which is time for another grocery haul. <laughs> it's a little cloudy day, Sunday, and I got some new lipstick. I think I'll do a video on this. I'm addicted to that NYX NYX lip velvet. This is like in, uh, I forget what this one, this is called, but it's purple. Can you tell? Kind of addicted to it, kind of addicted to it. Okay, today's magic number is $79.49. $79.49. And my husband Roy is working from home, so he might make an appearance. I don't know. Sorry if my voice is a little rough. It's a little cloudy, so it affects my voice. Plus, we kind of had a crazy weekend, of course. Um, I got to see an old punk band called the Murder Junkies. And if you're up with your rock and roll or punk um vocabulary or whatever is Gigi Allen's um band. Uh, of course Gigi Allen is dead. He was a punk rocker and uh but the original drummer and the original Merle, the original guitar player was there. So <clears throat> my voice is a little gone from the whole weekend because it was crazy. I'm gonna do a video about that later. It'll probably already be up up by the time this is posted because this is posting right now. It is the 13th of May, and sorry if you hear trash trucks. They're doing some kind of construction on the other side of the street, and it's very loud, very loud. In fact, let me go close the screen door. I don't know if that will help at all, but there we go. Anyway, let's get right to this. Ignore the dirty dishes. Since my husband's home, we got dirty dishes that I will attend to later. Okay, first off, get my creamer. As you know, I love my Cinnabon creamer. It's very good. It tastes like a Cinnabon, for real. So I got my creamer. And as you know, I Lysol the bedding. Every morning, I Lysol all, all over the house every morning. It's just so, I like the smell of it, and um, I like to disinfect. So I got Lysol. And I got a can of mixed nuts because we have some trail mix back there, but we're we're kind of everyone picks the nuts out, so I gotta add more nuts to the trail mix. And these are all the canned cat food for my Frankie. My Frankie cat. That's all the canned cat food for my Frankie cat. There you go. And I make salads all the time, so I got heart or romaine. Romaine is probably one of the best lettuces out there for you, so I got romaine. And my husband texted me and he wanted some kale, so I got, got some kale, so I'll probably mix that with the salads. So I got some kale. I don't kale. And as you always know, broccoli for the bird and for us. So we have three cats, a dog, and a bird, and a hubby. So we got broccoli, and then, you know, I'm trying to go vegetarian, slowly but surely. I have tried the Boca burgers, they're okay, but I want to try this Morning Star, and this is spicy Indian veggie patties. I don't know, they just sounded like they, has anyone tried these, are these good? Because I love Indian food. And it says it has curry in it. Coconut curry. So I can't wait to try these out. Sometimes I don't make it like a burger. Sometimes I just chop them up in a, in a salad. Uh, just to get the protein. So we'll try. I'll try that. Oops, try it. Actually. Okay. And for salads, I love mushrooms. I love mushrooms. So I got some mushrooms to go in the salads. And you know, I always get cheese because I'm a cheeseaholic. Reduced fat Mexican blend. I just love cheese. Who doesn't love cheese? I love cheese so much. So, so much. Then I always love cottage cheese because you know, I love to dip stuff with my crackers and I make my own little dips and cottage cheese is a good base for a dip and there's lots of protein this was on sale for only three bucks so the price was right low fat I think yeah I got low fat 
And then since I make my own dips, because I never know what kind of dips I want, I got uh, reduced fat sour cream. So, you know, I don't know. I was, I was looking online, some recipes to make, and they have this uh, corn dip. This corn dip looks amazing. Like it's made out of just yellow corn. And I love corn, so I might try making that. Sour cream. And that's another bag gone. And you know how we always get tortilla chips. So I got some tortilla chips. Of course, we still have two bags open. I don't know. Do your husbands do this? They always open two bags of chips. So then one goes stale. And then, like, or you get, because you get two bags open. So I think I'm going to mix it all in one bag. Because it's just, it's just ridiculous. Ridiculous, I swear. Then I love tomatoes. My new thing is like I like to slice tomatoes and put them on top of um, whole grain bread with some butter and I'll put some Italian seasoning and Parmesan cheese on top and I, I put them in the toaster oven, kind of like a, a pizza. So I get some onions and they're also good in salads. And then we have some eggs, but I got just a half thing of eggs because a lot of times I'll get a dozen eggs and I'll, um, I'll boil half of them, because boiled eggs, you can chop them your salad or whatever, just eat. Uh, and then the other ones I leave raw, so, you know, we want to cook breakfast or something like that. So I love eggs. We got eggs. Yeah, I have my hair down. I took it out, because, you know, after cutting it, I kind of want to enjoy it down. So I'm trying to enjoy it down as much as I can, although it bugs me. I keep playing with it. My husband texted me he needed two lemons. I don't know why he needs two lemons, but I got him two lemons. So there's some lemons. I don't know what he's going to make, but I got, him, I got him lemons. And he also texted me he wanted some plums, so I got him four plums. Because he's trying to eat more healthy because uh, he's going through radiation. I think he has three more weeks of radiation. He goes Monday through Friday in the morning to get radiation and I think I don't know if I showed you the picture on how he does radiation but they have a mesh thing on his head and they bolt his head down and they have to because they have to put, they have to really focus on where to put the radiation and if you don't know he had saliva gland cancer got it removed but he might have little fragments of cancer cells so he's going through radiation to uh, to ensure no cancer Okay, every week I get shredded carrots for the bird and I sprinkle them in the salads. And, little side note, I sprinkle them in Clyde's um, food, my French bulldog. Because sometimes, you know, if your dog does this, they eat too fast and they kind of choke and they gag or they can't breathe. Like, they just eat too fast. So sometimes when I notice what they do at Pussy and Pooch, they have like little uh, fish skin, like uh, crusty crispy um, skin and they put it in there and it kind of slows their roll like because they have to stop and crunch it so what I do is I sprinkle this on top of his food and it makes him where he doesn't eat it so fast he has to stop and actually chew these um this, these carrots so that's my little trick to, to slow him down from eating too fast And then Roy also texted me while I was at work that he wanted some more pears. Well, not more. We haven't got pears, but he wanted pears. So I got him three pears. I hope that's enough. Put that right there with his plums. Yeah, backs down. Okay, this is just kind of an impulse buy because it's close to 4th of July. And sometimes, even though I eat healthy, I do like a... Well, not really. I eat like crap. But they're cupcakes. Hostess cupcakes. Who doesn't love a cupcake? So, I don't know why. There's no story to this. I, they just looked good. They just looked good. And so I got them. I'm sure we'll eat them. I'm sure we'll eat them. Okay. And... He texted me he wanted some bananas, so I got him some bananas. Just a little, like, one, two, five. I got him five bananas. 
Let's put it up there. Excuse me. I'll put that up. All right. And every week, as you know, we always get tortillas. Just a staple. We always get tortillas. And I love my Melba Toast. Those are my favorite crackers. Old school. So yummy. So, so yummy. That bag's gone. And then, as you know, I always have to get cat litter. And I love the Glade because I like it to smell good. And I tried the lightweight kind, you know. They, they, that doesn't work good. You just got to get the old-fashioned scoop of all kind. It works the best. And I need more toilet paper. So I got my favorite, the aloe vera, vitamin E. And since Roy's been home a lot, and also with the radiation and um, and how they took out the, the saliva gland, his mouth is very dry lately, from especially from the radiation because it's burning his um, mouth a lot. Like it, it's, it's affecting his taste buds and stuff. So he's been drinking lots of water, so got more water. And that is $79.49, ladies and gentlemen. And there you go. I did get a few lippies. I'll, I put them in my purse already. I've been addicted to these things. NYX, it's called Velvet Cream. They have so many different colors. I'll probably do another video of it uh, later on it. But I'm trying to get all the colors. I ordered some online. And I'm just... I never really wear lipsticks. I usually just wear lip liner and a uh, lip balm. Uh, but these are like, it doesn't even feel like you have lipstick on. It's matte and it, it doesn't feel like you have lipstick on. So the hair doesn't stick to it and it doesn't like get all over everything. So I actually like these. Um, so yeah, I've been wearing lipstick. I kind of like it. So I guess this could be a short little haul. That's all I got for you. Nothing really special. I would show you the stuff I got at Ulta, but. Uh, oh, I could show you something. Let's see. I ordered something through Amazon. Because when we went to Punk Rock Bowling, um, everyone was wearing these uh, Punk Rock vests. And I'm like, oh my god, I want a Punk Rock vest. I actually kind of wanted um, black denim with lots of studs so I could put patches on it. But I couldn't really find exactly what I was looking for. But, I did come across this thing from Wet Seal. No, it's not food pie. So, let's see. Let's unbox it together, shall we? It's like a fake leather vest. Ooh. I forget how much this was. I think it was maybe less than $30. Ooh. I kind of like it. What do you think? So it's like if it's if it's too hot for a leather jacket, I could still kind of be uh, rock and rollish with a vest, and I could probably put a patch on the back. Oh yeah, I'm gonna be excited. I'm gonna put some patches on this. Let's Ooh yeah, boom boom. <laughs> I don't know. It kind of looks costumey, huh? Well, it looks costumey because I don't have a whole outfit around it, but. Yeah, let's see the zipper. Come on, zipper. There we go. Yeah. Yeah. It's so kind of a little loosey goosey, but I could probably tighten it right here. Yeah, I kinda like it. Now the ones I really wanted had like had studs all over and even around in the back a little bit, which is room for uh, a patch. But I could work with this. I could totally work with this. Yeah, I could totally work with this. Yeah, I don't know what patch I'm going to put on it. Maybe the Adolescence or Agent Orange. I don't know. Maybe Agent Orange because they're saying happy birthday to me. But All right, cool. I like it. I like it. What do you think? Well, I think it's cool. All I need is a bike now. All right. I'm going to let you guys go. To all my Stace Cadets and my Burkettes, I hope you're having a groovy day. Until next time, peace.